It's a great pleasure and it's a great honor to actually receive this big prize, the Pride of Performance, Presidential Pride of Performance, no small thing. I've always wanted to work for Pakistan uh, to uh, help Pakistan progress towards emerging technologies like artificial intelligence, robotics. It, it's, a, it's been a long road to try to introduce the emerging technologies in Pakistan like artificial intelligence, like robotics and how to modernize the Pakistani technologies uh, in order to get the best outcome for the for the country of Pakistan as a whole. Uh, today at the National Center of Artificial Intelligence, we have laboratories spread across all over Pakistan and we are uh, working on several different uh, things. We have made the uh, MS and PhD standardized curriculum, the national curriculum for Pakistan for artificial intelligence and made it available for all the Pakistani universities to access from our website. We got it approved from HEC as well. Uh, also, we've got uh, different projects that we've developed for the disabled community. We have uh, like uh, smart wheelchairs, we've got prosthetic limbs, we've got uh, 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 things for uh, children who are affected with autism spectrum disorder. We've got several other projects and particularly the RoboCup project I would like to mention which highlighted the name of Pakistan in the international community where we became the first team from South Asia to actually qualify for the topmost league of the robotics uh, contest. Uh, it feels good to uh, have uh, recognition for Pakistan, to have earned the recognition for Pakistan. Uh, there's yet a long way to go. Uh, there's a, a long road for Pakistan and Pakistani universities to actually make their mark and come parallel with big universities in the world like MIT, Carnegie Mellon, Tokyo University, etc. And like uh, we really uh, will try, inshallah, to play our part in it and to keep up the efforts that we've been doing so far.